What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Let's go. Let's get it, man. We got podcast and chill back up on deck, man. Let's go. Let's get it, man. But I'm excited getting this episode. This is a little throwback. This is episode 392. We got our boy Mo Pops on this episode. Let's go. Let's get it, man. Somebody got a comment said, Vern, if you really want to laugh, if you really want to laugh, you need to check out the episode with Mo Pops on this. So you know your boy got to. Simple as that, man. If you don't know about Mo Pops and Popcorn and Cheese podcast, you need to tap in. Simple as that. Let's go. And let's get it. I'm ready to shut up. I'm ready to have some fun. I'm ready to laugh. So let's go and let's have some fun. Hope everybody having a blessed day, getting ready to have a blessed night. Simple as that. Let's go and let's get it. SA number one podcast. Let's go. And now, what about that, ladies and gentlemen, straight from Dubai. Shake my grass. Straight from Dubai. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's only fitting because I'm the shake of podcast. <laughs> anyway, now, very many ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another edition of Podcast and Chill. We got a guest co host, by the way. Give it up for Umpa Pops. You're like part of the furniture now, man. You're family, bro. I think you're the only uh, celeb who's been on the podcast three times now. I am, no. yeah. First one. Yeah. Hey, I remember y'all said he's an actor. I got to dig into him. I have not checked the two because it's been so much, man. It's been so much with this podcast. Like, but I'm about to shut up. We're going to dig in this, but we have to dig in more on our boy Mo Pops. So let's go. We give him some volume there. His mic is a bit low. Yeah, bring it closer there. Bring it closer. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Hey. They'll make you a meme, don't do yeah, that. Exactly. He said, don't, hey, <laughs> don't get yourself. Don't get yourself. Don't they forget itchy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ghost Lady is here as well. Yep, yep. I saw couldn't be here, man, because yeah. um, he's got um, he's got fever. He's got a rash. What else he's got? But he's, hey. he's got a flu. Yeah, a fever. I I'm Kale. Like, oh. It's hard. It's so if you're watching the Paul and so yeah, on. Yeah, my dog. Yeah, but be Barno back. War. In. Nila. Nila. <laughs> I will make sure your seat is warm and your invoice is taken care of. Skawara <laughs> Jaka. You got big shoes to fill there, eh? literally. Yeah, no, <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about it, I'm like, fuck, man. Maybe it's Saul's body saying, like, yo, take it easy, man. It is, guys. It you know? is. We, we are overloading us. Guys, you guys are on. Mm. You guys are proper on. You know what I mean? So besides, besides the podcast, Let's count everything else Sol is doing. Because yeah. he's probably the hardest working yeah. yes, oh, person. Oh, Him and Robert Boy, they, they, they're fighting for that title. <laughs> <laughs> and we got to get on our boy, our robot boy, Robert Boy, man. Simple as that, man. He said, we have to dig in on the work of everybody. So it's like, expect the podcast, expect the music. I got a lot of work to do, man. I appreciate y'all so much. Let's go and let's get it. <laughs> so much work. I mean, think about it. Think about it, right? We gotta okay, dig cool. in on everybody. Person. Normal person. Yeah. You wake up in the morning. You turn on the radio, you hear so mm-hmm. on Kai. All right, shut. You get to work. When you get to work, lunch break, you're like, ah, let me go on social media, see what's happening. So it's trending. Yeah. So it's trending. So it's retweeting, yeah. commenting yeah. on every tweet. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And then Working. you get home, you turn on your TV. So it's trending. Well dressed, <laughs> presenting a show. You're like, when did this happen? <laughs> This nigga's an actor too. Then you decide, yeah, then you decide Yeah, no, no, no. Then you decide, yeah, let me go on, on YouTube or something. Yeah, I'm yeah. tired of TV. Let me go yeah. on YouTube. Fuck. <laughs> so long. <long's. laughs> so long, Zipendo. Just when you're thinking, okay, let me just go to the club. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let me go to the club. <laughs> <laughs> they said they were that bitch DJ. Look at my eyes. <laughs> They said my nigga love that fast life, that hustle life, that go get a life, man. He said it's just too much, it's too much. <laughs> no ways, it's too much, guys. <laughs> But you probably had something like that because you do a lot of shit as well, bro. Yeah. Your and body says, man. Your body tells you at some point, no, this is enough. Mm. You, you can't do this anymore. And that's the thing with us creatives. The busier you are, the less, I don't know if you've noticed, the less creative you are. Because oh. you're, just, you're just going. You're just like, let me finish. Let me collect. But your creativity starts getting less and less and less. Only when you take a break does your creativity come back. 
Yeah. Yeah. But the thing is, with this industry, you're only on top for so long. You're not going to be on top forever. That's the mentality. The mentality is strike. I don't like his mic. Can you move it up a bit? I can't hear him properly, man. Just move it up. Yeah, there we go. So the, the, yeah, the, the mentality is oh. strike with, while you're hot, right? Yes, yes. And the thing is, <laughs> dog, if you're hot for a long time, mm. you know what I mean? Mm. Like, it's, it's not like, look, and, and I'm not throwing shade at anyone, but there are people who literally have a season where like, you, you have a hit for like six months or mm. nine months or a year. You're hot for that time. You can gig all out for a year. You guys have the biggest bot- podcast in mm. Africa. Mm. You're mm. going to be hot for a while, mm. you know? And Sol is good at the other shit he does. Mm. He's good at his TV gigs. He's good yeah. at, his, at his radio gig. Wow. He's good at DJing. So wow. you got five or six things you're hot at. Don't forget, you might go to a pageant and he's MC. <laughs> <laughs> And let's give Souls his flowers, man. Let's give Souls his flowers. Suppose that I can't wait to react to and dig into his lifestyle, man. Let's go, let's get it. I know, Dandy Dandy Drew. This play I Shundu Fazo Marinzi. Anyway, go slate if you've been to Dubai, bro. No. Oh, oh guy, guy. Who's been to Hands in the air. Hands in the air. You got a fucking in the air. Hand hand Ghost lady, it is beautiful. It's it is unreal. pure opulence. It is like playground of the rich. Mm. It's like the buildings are huge. Everything yeah. is just big. It's yeah. beautiful. Mm. I never knew there were so many POPs though. Oh, there were so many POPs there. Wow. I thought you said POP. <laughs> what so many Shangan people in Dubai? What are you, what are you going on about? <laughs> no, 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 P-O-P, uh, yeah. Proof of payment. Uh, like girls that you have to buy. Like they that are selling. Oh, there he was a lot so, of girls to buy. In... He says so many POPs. Dubai. Dubai. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so you started seeing familiar faces, No, it's just like they're just selling everywhere, bro. Yeah, dog, it's it's where the rich play. It makes sense. Yeah. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's why the red light district used to pump so much back in the day. Mm. is because you knew that was the best place to go mm. to get stuff. So the red light district wouldn't just have ladies from Amsterdam. It would have ladies from all over the all world. All over the world. Because oh. they knew that was the street yes. to get the top quality. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. So that's what Dubai has become. Because now we don't live in a society that goes, I we are good red light district in your tanga. Mm. Now I want to go to a place where it's disguised as. Yeah, of course. And that's what Dubai gives you. Yeah. You don't even have to mac, oh, lady. Mm. You just go, how much for a blowjob? 2,000 dirhams. All right, Azam. Oh, but it's a 2,000 for a blowjob. Ah. 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 Oh. Oh. Andy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, baby, my guy, boy. <laughs> 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 then I just <laughs> moved up my dick. He's like, says, I get a coat, <laughs> please. So yeah, naked and <laughs> I get a quote per so lead. Yeah, my name Mulaga is two. My lead. Three dera. Okay, Mulaga. Mula One, two, three. <laughs> there's, there's, there's a girl, there's a Russian girl we met at some hotel we're at. Like, there's a pool party. From 11 a.m., the pool party starts until like 10 p.m. So we went out there and she wanted to have a threesome. I was like, damn. With another girl or with No, 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 with me. <laughs> <laughs> no, with me and my, 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 my woman. <laughs> <laughs> no, with me and my woman. Because oh, I went there with my snap. woman. Yeah. She wanted to have a threesome, this Russian girl, man. Oh, What snap. did she say? Like, what? Did, he, did she just. Who proposed it? Yeah. yeah. Who proposed it? No, she proposed. She was like, Are you guys game for, like, obviously the English is bad, uh-huh. but we could hear. Hey. Yeah. You guys want to. <laughs> 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 Of us. You know. <laughs> and let me guess, at this point, you didn't answer, you just looked at your woman. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're never gonna see her again. <laughs> <laughs> That's Vladimir put in the shit. <laughs> he said we never what do you do when you put in a situation like that, though? Oh. Nah bro, I mean I mean oh. what can you do, bro? Oh. But it was wild, like they're just so free, man. Yo, wow. You know? And how much for the threesome? I uh, wouldn't get to the price. Yeah. <laughs> wouldn't get to the price. Oh. But it's so crazy. Like, um, oh, my stomach hurt, uh, w- when did you go to Dubai? I went to Dubai before pandemic. I think 2019, mm. 2018. 
Um, and same, I went, oh, it was, yo, guys, it was a magical trip. Like, mm. I experienced everything you're saying. You get there and you realize, well, it's just rich people and wealthy people. Yeah. Yeah. The rich are the middle class of Dubai. It's new money. <gasps> it's new. The, it makes, so the it rich makes are the middle money. class. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Everyone there is rich. Yeah. And then there's the super elite. Yes. Wealthy. It okay. makes the UK look like a village. Yeah, it's like new money, bro. Mm. They all got money and they're all rich. They don't work. And it's the only country where the black people are not at the bottom. It's yeah. the Pakistanis and the Indians yeah. at the bottom. Oh. Yeah. Then the blacks. Then the, okay. Yeah. Okay. But what's crazy, what I wanted to tell you is that um, everything that you see in Dubai right now, 20 years ago, wasn't there. Yeah. It yeah. was a desert. It That's didn't exist. Like... It's, it's almost like being in Dubai is almost like, have you ever been to Sun City? Yeah. You know when you start seeing where Sun City is actually built and it's not actually this lost palace. Oh. Because Sun City has this aesthetic, yeah, or, this lost palace and oh. these and there's these rivers that run through it but one day when you're on your balcony you see the the bubbles coming from the pump next to the yeah, you know, yeah. you're like oh this is a pool not a river <laughs> <laughs> so dubai is like that where you'll be by the beach and you realize oh no this is not actually a beach beach mm, yeah, it's these, man-made yeah. these seagulls were brought here yeah. these seagulls are not from here yeah mm. this water is still i haven't seen a wave so again like there's there's that whole thing of like dubai is built mm. and you see it mm. but they did it no, they did. The, 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 the rich didn't. After everybody got on Vegas, the rich and the wealth and said, "Fuck it, let's go a little further. Let's go further, further. Let's go to Dubai and do the same thing." Cause that didn't exist twenty years ago. It's a desert, man. The mob and everybody just created that same. I, said, I can't wait, man. I gotta hit the motherland first. You already know that. Then after that, Dubai is next. Simple as that. Magnificent. magnificent. So how the guy did Vegas it so is the sheik now um, used to travel with his dad the previous sheik and go to all these countries and he saw what people were doing like in other countries mm-hmm. and he's like i'm gonna do this for my people so 20 years ago that's when he started building uh, uh, uh dubai as we know now and wow. they're still continuing bro like the the burj khalifa yeah they're gonna build another building bigger than that what and did you go to the Burj Khalifa? yeah, yeah of yeah, course yeah, you got yeah, it you got yeah, it yeah, yeah, yeah. and also they're, they're building an underground city really yeah they're also building their own moon hey <laughs> Hey, yeah, what? Wait, whoa! Hey. Put it back! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Hey! hey. <laughs> Not the Come back! <laughs> Come back! Come back! Come Burj Khalifa and all these things! And hey. the old moon! The old moon, bro! Let me research don't, it for don't you. Don't they have a piece... In Dubai, they've got like a piece of land or... I don't know. I guess they know how to like... Get sand out of the water yeah. and turn it into land. Okay. So there's this project they've been working on that's shaped like the continents of the of the world. Oh yes. And then you can buy that piece of land. So you can buy Africa. Someone can buy yes. Australia. And then you can basically build like a a big house on it and and have land. Uh-huh. Yeah. So uh-huh. that's the one thing I knew that they, they they literally built the planet again. Yeah. In water. Yeah. Now they're building a moon. Yeah, here we go. Five billion dollar moon shaped hotel in Dubai will let you experience outer space on Earth. These niggas are wild. You can't (laughs) keep the lights on. (laughs) 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 (laughs)
So I know that feeling when you mm. pass Dubai, like of the heat. So when we left, when we came out of the aeroplane, it was just too hot. It you hits you. Yeah. Know? The only other place I've, I've experienced that is Nigeria. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 And 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 even in that heat, you'll see three guys on a bike together. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> Wearing leather jackets. <laughs> <laughs> Not sweating. <laughs> Wearing flip flops. <laughs> but when you realize that, you're like, "Fuck, man! If we had a better government, we could be like miles ahead, bro." Because there's yeah. so much potential. Yeah. This yeah. country, we've got the weather. Fuck, we've bro, got we've the got land. Everything. We've got weather. We've got well-educated people. We've got young people with dope, creative Ooh. ideas. Ooh. Right. Mm. We've got Elon Musk, who was born from here. Can just, we can just, you know, us. help us build some but, energy source. But that's the thing, because he the government he help, hasn't invested back in... He said he can help us build an energy source. Like, we got Elon Musk. Like, niggas, like, come on. Hey, you know what? I, I see this happening. You know what's crazy? In the next 20 years, oh, it's going to be amazing. I might be living over there then. Like, this is going to be amazing. Like, I, let's speak this shit in existence for the motherland. Let's just speak... Like, positivity and hope people build like they build in Vegas, like they did in Dubai. Let's hope. What's up? Like, guys, speak that shit. Is that it, it wasn't there? If y'all don't got it now, y'all can have it in the next 20. We can have it in the next 20. Simple as that. Just, you know, just help us build some but, energy. Source. But that's the thing because the government hasn't invested back into the country, it's now losing creatives. So your Elon Musk, your Trevor Noah's, your Black it. Coffee. When you go there, you're like, ah, I say, okay, I'll go there. I got December. He looks like he's kicking you on the same phone. I'm just chill with the family, get Briar. Come, Chen. Go on. There's this crazy thing they have. It's called U-Drive. You literally, you literally request a car. You drive the car, and then wherever you want to park it, you just leave it there. Mm. Bro, there's something even more crazy. Mm. Whoa. Uh, you drive, that's crazy. Hold on. It's called you drive. You literally, you literally request a car, you drive the car, and then wherever you want to park it, you just leave it there. Mm. Bro, there's something even more crazy. Mm. Uh, there's a thing that you get as well, celebrities have overseas, um, where you can request a same thing, yeah. like Uber, mm. but for private jets. Whoa! Oh. Yeah. I've seen that in Brazil, it's big as well. Yeah. Oh. You just you request, and wherever you are, They'll find a way to get you from where you are to the to the the run field or the airport. Okay. So if you are in let's say New York and the nearest airport, they go kaika, they'll either send a chopper to meet you at this building and then it'll fly you there, or they'll get a limo, they'll take you Ooh. to your plane and you fly out. Bro, that's the kind of opulence I'm talking about. Mm. I went to an African restaurant uh, to have dinner and um them goals come on man them, them fuck goals like because that's only goals for certain people that really them goals for me but them levels there's levels to this shit man and that's basically what they're saying right now okay. well they'll get a limo they'll take you to a plane and you fly out Shh. bro that's the kind of opulence i'm talking about mm. i went to an african restaurant uh to have dinner and um, the food gets delivered by a robot. <laughs> it's wild, man. <laughs> Wait, was it an African robot? No. <laughs> 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 it came very late. I can't get In an African timing. <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> hey, while I'm chilling there eating my food, you know. Biggest song in SA comes on. Hi, bro. Hey, my new single. Ngandin. <laughs> wait, wait, in Dubai. In Dubai. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I went to the beach. I'm like, this so, is my song. It's so like, the came on. No. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're coming with funny. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but. <laughs> 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 So, so the DJ plays my song. I go up to him like, this is my song. You can tell he doesn't know who the fuck I am. Oh, oh shit. I thought he played it because, you know, like, they like, yeah. like, oh, he's here. Yeah. No, he let's play his song. Play song. He, didn't, he didn't even notice your song. He didn't know it, bro. He didn't know me. That's when you know you have a hit. Bro. And it's so crazy. When we started what? the year, right? Um, uh, Myself, Spot and Cook. Oh, yeah. Y'all already know that reaction coming next. Y'all know that's coming next. Simple as that. Come on, man. It's like, I think it's a music video to it, too. Simple as that, y'all know that's coming next. He didn't, he didn't even notice your song. He didn't know it, bro. He didn't know me. That's when you know you have a hit. Bro. And it's so crazy. When we started what? the year, right? Um, uh, Myself, Saul, and Ghost Lady. Uh, I asked them, what's your uh, uh, 
What, what else you guys? What do you want this year? Man? What's like you? Good player. For no time. And my thing is, I wasn't really thinking about it. I was just like, ah, what, what do I want that I don't have right now? I was like, I just want a hit. Hey. Yeah, you've got a hit. Oh, six hits in the EP, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, God bless me with six hits. Hi, six hits. Remember when you were like this? Six hits? Hold on, we're going to have to react to the whole EP. Simple as that. It's a song mm. I found in my archives. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Like, yeah artist? No, 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 no. Okay. No, he hasn't touched his uh, archives. No. no he, now he just put his name on it. Yeah, I didn't produce any of these songs. I can't release my name, my songs. I... So you, you pour into the situation? Yeah, <laughs> I learned from the best. <laughs> music have you guys heard the brand new aka oh no, yes. uh, lemonade yeah lemonade yeah i heard it mm. uh and i'm just glad nice everyone piece, is AKA. on the bandwagon you know mm. uh, what i'm not the only one that song is very piano esque what i oh, know man it's good I, I, I heard the song i'm like this song is dope right yeah and then i heard mm -hmm. The log drum, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. the logo drum, yeah, yeah, yeah. the logo drum, and and uh, look, I give I give this up to Ken, and Ken knows how to sample, right? yeah, like yeah, like that music sounds better than you, you, baby. Yeah. That song is a smash, yeah. yeah. So to take that, so get that in the comments. Music sound better with you, but I probably find it before because I'm on I'm on, I'm on Mac G and I'm on that man. We gonna do a little throwback for AKA man. Simple as that. Um, and to get it to where it's at with this new record he put out, that mm. ah, sounds dope. I but nasty C on the. Oh. Yo, the show, the show, the show. Nasty for real. The show, the show. What did you stop playing? Stop playing. You heard him. He put nasty C, and I love that everybody get hyped for nasty C like I do. Simple as that. Chef nasty on the motherfucking track. Simple as that. Hey, y'all, let me know in the comments. Hey, y'all ain't gotta let me know. I'm looking it up. Simple as that, man. I'm waiting on some new heat. Put out. Mm. Ah, I like how they just got hyped, man. What did you think, Gosley? Yay! I, I just loved it more, especially for the fact that what you know, AK has gone through. Yeah. Just to see him back, and he's actually at the same league. You know, it's like he's on, he's on this like the AK we've known. Kenan is a hit maker. Yeah. So I was just happy. Rest in like, peace, hey, man. AK is I back. I think yeah. Keenan is probably the best hip hop artist to come out of this country. Wow. Yeah. After hearing that song. Yeah. Yeah, look, guys, you have to give it up to AKA. Hit after hit after hit. Keenan is actually in love with the music. Yeah. Hey, let me pivot it real quick. I love how they was giving him his flowers before. You know what I'm saying? Because this is before that, um, it's like before that happened. It's like, I'm just blessed that everybody like really gave him his flowers while he was here and he was able to receive them for it. Cause this is basically they gave him his flowers, man. They gave him his due diligence. You have to give it up to AKA. Have to. Give him hit his flowers. Hit after hit after hit. Kenan is actually in love with the music. Yeah. He doesn't, he doesn't make music to it's suit timeless, whatever. Timeless, yeah. bro. So, so Kenan cooks. Yeah. You know what I mean? He goes into the studio and he Being cooks. In the mm. cooks. He doesn't go. Hey, what are people liking right now? What's the what's the thing? What's the thing? Let me let me just go. Let me just do whatever the market wants. Mm. He goes, I need to put out something that's a banger. Mm. And he takes time and he cooks. This song, I heard it. I was like, this is a hit. But how about KO though? Yo, put KO same, in the same same. Well? Guys, KO, KO, because uh, we gotta talk about KO. longevity and yes, catalog. Yes. He's the Ryan Giggs of the game. Uh huh. KO, ah, uh, yeah. KO. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I still lean towards AKA more, man. Uh, like that guy. Oh, but like, KO. Yeah, bro. Oh, KO. Uh, KO. KO, though. KO, KO. yeah. KO, yeah. yeah. KO has been the game. So, and yeah. he's got a big song right now. Set oh, this. Set it. it. So, oh. But that's what I'm saying is that um, I think from a reach point of view, obviously AKA, because AKA got the younger audience that grew with him. Now everyone's older. Even the young people are still, you know, what, what with AKA. But I think KO, though. KO's been... On since Nakuhele. Since Tegas. Since Tegas. The gas has run out. Over oh, 10 years. Tears. 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 joy. Tears. joy. Tears. Tears. joy. This nigga is making us cry. This nigga is. Tears. Tears. It's so weird we talk about this. The other day on my, on my, on, on my random playlist, bro, Karakara came on. Yo. 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 
Yo, I like, bang, bro. You know when you're not expecting a song? Huh. Like, ay, 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 like the turning point of piano was Bo Shesha Yes, 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 yes. When Shesha Keza and them were coming up, that's when we were like, yeah. ah, piano's on now. Mm. When KO did uh, Karakara Kara Kara. Kara. Mm. And, and, and everything that kind of followed around, mm. ah, dog, that's when, honestly speaking, for me, South African hip hop was doing well, mm. but that's what cemented South African hip hop. Yeah. I'm so, shocked. I'm shocked you still listen to AK because what Usha Bilaga Steen? Oh, I'm not Usha Bilaga Steen, I'm not. <laughs> and Kasim Lima, not just any state. Face free. What's the last thing I said in the mula? Could have been a graduate. Don't you really learn to? You quit school. Yes. And then you're like, oh, bitches like to laugh. Let me be a comedian. <laughs> I grew up with a single mom, Nick Bala Cosmopolitan. <laughs> what do women like? A man with a Make sense of humor. humor. <laughs> a guy makes me laugh. Can I? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot to tell you guys in Dubai you can't Google porn. I tried, you can't. Hi, yeah, yeah, I was also found out with my friend when I was there. <laughs> <laughs> what was your friend Googling? What my friend you? told me when he went on. <laughs> A message came up saying, hey, you don't want to do that. <laughs> really? Yeah. There's, a, there's a thing that, there's a gif that comes up. <laughs> <laughs> you can't, like it's bulletproof. Yeah. Even when you try, go through other channels, goes, hey, hey. Oh. You have to go via Twitter. Yeah. Mm. My friend was also saying that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm. <laughs> Hey, that is crazy though. They're not having it. They said no. You ain't looking at nothing. You gonna get what we saw. <laughs> they hate it. That's crazy. They blocked. That and that is crazy over there, y'all. Let's go. Let's get it, man. I don't know if you said the same thing. What black beats? I, I see what they do. I think we have the same friend coming. What went to the same friend? <laughs> Man, can we just go to fucking Nasty C's verse, man? This kid is fucking amazing, bro. Sure. Yeah, honest, dude, honestly, Kenan, nah, pound for pound, Kenan is a hit maker. And, and I love what you said, Ghosty, like, even after everything he's been he's through, because he's through. been through a lot, right? Yeah. The fact that he can still deliver this quality, of, and especially in the era of everything piano, everything yeah. piano. Um, look, I, I, do, I do feel like the song has a, a dope-ass log drum in it. Yeah. It's not as piano as piano. No, you know who started that sound. It reminds me of like Sondela. You know that Sondela. Yeah, you know who started that sound. Tyler ICU. He did uh, the one with Ricky Rick um, and Lucas Raps. Um, Isn't it Sondela? In the club. Yeah, that came after. That, that came after. Yeah. Lucas Raps, Tyler ICU, Ricky Rick. What it is? What, what it is? What's, What's up? up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's the sound. Yeah. I'm trying to think, y'all. I don't remember that, man. We got another banger I got to react to. Simple as that. Y'all already know, Lucas, because I don't think I did that, man. Get in the comments, but it might already be done by the time y'all see this, man. I ain't what it is. Oh, What's up? Boom, boom. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. That's the sound. Yeah. That's the sound. Yeah. But that's, because for me, I'm just like, guys, this thing of like hating on sounds, let's just jump on, bro. This is this is a sound that's ours. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, we own it. Yeah. No one else in the world owns yeah. the sounds. Instead of fighting each other for the sound, because the sound can take us far. But I've studied Keenan. What he does is that um, he samples dance music. Yeah. Uh, drops yeah. The, the, the BPM, makes it slower, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And then gets a dope beat and then kills the, 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 no, 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 the chorus. Yeah. He always does the chorus and then he gets a dope rapper to come add some spice. Ah. Yeah. 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 But the dope rapper doesn't overpower him in the song. So you can't say Nasty Kill, a.k.a. Cause oh, like Nasty was fire. Yo! Oh, I let me read you the. Here you go. I Keep a nice thing with lips and curves in my corner, at ten on my lap. Maradona. I. I'm giving her some class. Cabernet Sauvignon. Her. I don't know what. What is that? It's, it's a wine. wine. Oh, okay. Why wouldn't you not jean thing? Cabernet Sauvignon. That's wine. 
don't know what that is. <laughs> Here's my favorite line. When I made a gag, I was going for a tonsil. Yay! <laughs> he said, yay! You know what that means? He said, yo, in view it. Have you experienced it? So I was going for a tonsil. We can the uh, when I murdered dad, I told him I'm, I'm an apostle. Damn, that nigga a fossil. Now everything is all right. You see my new car, right? I pulled up in the show and they were sleeping. The energy weak. I gave them some motive. Zaba, 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 zaba. Always out the country. I guess I'm Zai Zai. Hey, 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 <laughs> I think it's uh, I can see you know when someone's always out the country, what oh, via via was Zaya Zai. Oh, oh Zaya Zai. Yeah. Oh, Zaya Zai was a person. Oh, Kazaya. <laughs> oh, like Kazaya, like Kazaya. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, when they pull me over, uh, oh, here's his yeah, 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 yeah. When they pull me over, I'm black, I might die. No, SAP is cool drink, high five. Oh, <laughs> oh no, I get it. <laughs> No, S A, what a place to reside. Yes. Do you get it now. Tides, Durban, the ever great side. Live on the highway, pepper steak pie. <laughs> now you, can. you know the pie. <laughs> what does this end? Pepper steak pie. <laughs> if 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 you love the streets, you've had a pepper steak pie oh, yes. on the highway. Yes. Oh man. Uh, but uh. black don't crack, so I bet I age fine. Got a little thing called ties. Rolled a little cold dice. She rolled a little things called eyes. Rolled a little thing called rhymes. Never told lies. You just couldn't see it with your own eyes. Guys, I love it. Look, guys, I won't lie. Nah, like, I, I'm, a, I'm the biggest piano fan in the world. Yeah. But it's... It's tracks like this that make you realize how much we've missed that mm. hip hop that hip hop influence. You yeah. know what I mean? Like Oaks are talented out there. Yes. Yeah. Oaks like we and what happened is piano came on and, and hip hop kinda decided to backtrack a bit mm -hmm. or to go, let's wait, or wh whatever hip hop was doing. Mm. And we didn't have Who's your top five, bro? In SA. In SA piano or uh, let's do hip hop first. Hip hop. Hip hop. Oof. Caspan your vest. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's the beef with my Jean Casper, man? Let me know, let me know in the comments. Simple as that. Let's go. Yes, nah. <laughs> 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 I'm going to edit this out. People are going to be like, why are you supposed to find it? <laughs> nah, dude. Uh, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Are you friends with him, bro? In your V. Yeah, oh, that's my dude, man. Yeah. That's my dude. He's, he's, he's good people. For real. And couple. They, they told me. Yeah, that. I like couple. Couple is funny. Funny as fuck, bro. Couple can. Yeah. Couple's funny. You don't think it's industry? Your vest. Your vest is a businessman, bro. Mm -hmm. Your vest is. He, he does what he needs to do to get on mm. and to stay on. Yeah. Whatever needs to happen must happen. And but it doesn't mean he must be a shit person. He can still do that and be a dope guy. Look at yourself. Hey, man. <laughs> like at his level, you know. And you never know what, what anyone has been through to, to become the person that they are. I what, just don't, what, whatever that is. Bro, you know I just mean? don't subscribe to this industry bullshit, man. I hate there's it with the, the passion, bro. There's some people that are like, and it's weird. And it's happened to me with a lot of, with a lot of guys that, are, that I know who are industry. There are people who can, like you and I can chill like this, right? Yeah. Any fucking time. Even without the cameras. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But then there are people that when you chill with them like this, or so, or mm -hmm. like this, we're exactly like this. And then all of a sudden, four people enter the room and they become industry. <laughs> and they become, yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, well, we don't drink this. What is this? Get this away. Hey, make sure we get this. We only eat this. We don't. And you're like, yo, bro. We... So oh, who does on. that? Who does that? You want, you want like this. Who does that? I'm not gonna mention any names. Hi. Oh. You know? I don't know. This is it like that in comedy? <coughs> no. Yeah, comedians, comedians, just... comedians are the most down to earth yeah. people because our job is like to listen to the world. You know? Yeah. We, we study human behavior. Mm. So you can't act up or switch up yes. when you're a comic. A lot of that you'll find with uh, telenovela stars, mm. soap stars, you know, people who have, who have musicians. Musicians. They don't know how to turn off the. Let's 
I'm not famous anymore. Yes. Turn off, just go yes. back to normal. Yeah. Oh. And, you, and they, and you they take it home. They take okay. it home. They, they take, take it with them when they go out. And it's heightened mm. when they're around other people. Or they're around other people like them. Oh. And then they look at you weird like, how? Why are you wearing flip-flops? <laughs> what, how? We're here. Why aren't we? Mm. You're just having a beer. Why aren't we? Mm. Oh. Mm. Sparkling lights. And it's like, no, guys. You, you know, be famous on TV and the things you need to do. You don't have to go out and make people feel a certain way or make people feel uncomfortable around you. Mm. You know, I, I watch things like that, bro. How you treat people that you're with yeah. and how you treat people that work for you. Yeah. Mm. You know, you, you see how they treat their PAs or, they, or their drivers or stuff like that. You're like, oh, guys, mm. there's no need for... So, so I get you when you say industry. Mm. There are people who are like industry, but what, what most people don't have, and that's, that's what I'm saying to you, is don't forget, people don't have this family system you built. Oh, you know, you can still be MacGyver because you have all these people that keep you grounded. No, 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 shake and quips. Oh, no, shake, shake quips. <laughs> you know, bitty bitty, shake quips. Get it right, get it right. What's up, boy, kitty? Kitty seven, steady robot. Robot boy, what's up, MacGyver? Time to break. It's very killer, sir. Episode, Girl. <laughs> just like oh, the UK. It's a must. It's a must. My boys from Dubai. Hey, did you, did you they laugh? know him. Did you hear Tabak's laugh? Like a horse pipe. <laughs> <laughs> Was that someone's laugh? Yeah. Huh? It's a man. I'm like, hey, Tabak. <laughs> I'm not going to get generated. There's no change. Go ahead and talk to me. Change the say, Tabak. Weak as shit, though. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. He tells me yeah. yeah, yeah. This nigga's in tears at this point, man. That's funny as hell. You're big top five, man. <laughs> top five. Um, KO is in my top five. Hands down. Hands down. Uh, Blackie. Ooh, you made it in top five. Wow. Yeah. Nah, He's actually nominated. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. about damn time, man. Yay. Kid is talented. Blackie. Um, Rouge. Rouge. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't yeah. expecting yeah. that. No, no, no. I, yeah, no, Rouge. Dude, she's, I, she's Rouge, fire. Rouge is fire. And mm. you know where I saw Rouge work hard? It's so weird. Um, and this is not the, like the actual platform, but like I saw Rouge have to do raps about different topics every week on like <coughs> sorry some cost light show she did with Donovan. Oh yeah, yeah the cost light yeah. show. Yes, yes, yes. I remember. So that. to see her. Because Rouge is talented, right? Yeah. Like, I, like I, I dig everything about her. But to see her adapt to that week in, week out, and to still kill it, I was mm. like, ah. Mm. <coughs> I, I, I mess with Rouge. Mm. Nasty. Woo! Definitely. Nasty C, ah. a.k.a. Yeah. Chef Nasty There's a lot of new school cats in your yeah, top five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. the old school guys that I, that I F's with are gone, you know? So I'm not going to put them in the list. Mm. I, I, I'm a, I'm a proper flabberisto, me. Mm. Oh. Flabber. Mm. Yeah, no, flabber was. Double HP. Mm. Flabber, flabber. Mm. Double Grab HP. Grab the bull by the horns. Stakeholder. Come mm. on. Oh. 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 You hear it, Mukwebo. Yes, yes. <laughs> Shake my uta. Grab the bull by the horns. Stakeholder. Amen. Amen. I couldn't afford to pay the bill because Ben Clou paid you. I think after that line, Slicker's like, I just say, but things don't work. Slicker quit after you heard that line. He was like, still, they were playing the song back. <laughs> Couldn't pay the foot to pay the bill because we threw Pegil. Who's that? The room went down there. Never. Around there. At the offline, let me go out. Let me go out. Let me go out. What's in the table, AKA? Let's go online and start the drink. 
Couldn't afford to pay the bill because they're super cute. That ain't weak as shit. Naked. Niggas are busy zang zang. Zang zang. Who said my can be? Who did you be killed? Asking you for a way no Odin. What? Hey, I want to ask y'all a question, man. Did they start the Popcorn and Cheese podcast after this episode? Because I feel like they did. I feel like they were so lit. He was having such a ball. He was like, bro, you need to be in this. Like, you need to be. That's why y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. Let me know if I'm right or wrong. Suppose that. Forty large. <laughs> when you know you <laughs> should be you. I can't afford to pay the bill. <laughs> 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 He's the type of guys when they ask you, do you want spring still water in a restaurant? No, no, tap. Please. Tap, tap. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> you should pick you. Alright, alright, number one, number one. <laughs> Ah oh, man, so yeah, so 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 like I said, Java, Java and Java and uh, Flava. Yeah, Flava are like my yeah. faves, my faves, yeah. my faves. No ah Cuesta. man, uh, no cool cat. Hey, cool wait cat a minute, so wait, how do I forget Questa? Guys, no ways. Mm. So I've been a Questa fan from day one. Yeah. yeah, from and I think that's why the reason why also like Flava. Became such a big thing for me is because he started working with Questa. Oh yes, yes, right. But a big, yeah. Nah, my number one's Questa. Mm. Nah, hands down. Mm. Also, what he did to these uh, Oaks with this uh, battle thing that was happening, guys. Questa oh, yes. has a way with words in different languages. Hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. Like he can do wordplay in English, do it in Zulu, do it in Swana in the same song. That's crazy, man. So yeah, so I'll go. Yeah, I'll go. Nasty, Fats. Blackie, K.O., um, Questa. No, A.K.A. A.K.A. No, Java. No, Mars Java's, I wouldn't say Java's more hip-hop. Yeah, strange. that's ambitious. But, yeah. Java. Yeah. <laughs> we have to hear what Java's... I, have Java dropped anything new? Man, we got to get up on all our artists, man. Simple as that. See, think I ain't new heat for 2024. Simple as that. Songs sound like when he's alone. What's been happening, man? What do you guys think about this Kelly Kumala thing? I haven't been following it, but it sounds wild, man. This week, what happened? Hey, man. Also, Ghost, you're going to have to fill us in because I there's too many things happening now. There's Guys, this thing happened how many years ago? A few years, yes. Yeah, a few years, right? Yeah, yeah. Like in 2014, right? 2014. Yeah, That's eight like years eight years ago. Because what I heard, I'm paraphrasing you. I don't know the real story. Eight years ago. Because what I heard, I'm paraphrasing you. I don't know the real story. Yeah. Fact check and you'll check for me. But what I heard is that apparently the 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 sister and Kelly, Senzo was fucking the sister. Yeah, basically. Oh. Was also sleeping with the sister. Damn. You see what I mean, right? So I, I, I oh, fact checker, fact checker. Give her a mic there. Yeah. Give her the mic. Give her a mic. Yeah. <laughs> Is it true, babe? Eba? I don't know if it's true because it's speculated, but apparently yeah. there's a witness who will be coming forth to state that that was the whole argument in the house. <sighs> Does this witness have a show on Moja Love? <laughs> <laughs> Opa follow up. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> 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 That's why. So there's a witness in the pipeline who can verify Hori. <coughs> These ones were chowing each other mm. on the side. So, 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 does that now change the narrative? Does that mean that this could have been instead of it being someone else, could this have been like a yeah? Because it, it seems like, like a domestic violence case. Yes, mm. where Kelly shot. Uh, Senzo. Senzo. After finding out. Oh, they say or, some or, oh, it's, um, or they was, say... was Kelly trying to shoot the sister? Ah. Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm trying yeah, to find yeah. out. And then Senzo. Hmm. But I don't know. Oh, keeper. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> My name is Saul Solom Zipenduka. I've lost weight. But I am Saul. This is not. Hey, these niggas are wrong. Hey, now he 
laughing so hard he jumped out of his chair though. Hey, he got back G weak as fuck though though. Mo pop silly as fuck, y'all. Let's go. Let's get excuse my cousin. <laughs> Look, what's this shit? What's this nigga leap out the chair laughing so hard though? <laughs> up a can of worms, That's bro. what I'm saying, right? Because now it becomes, oh, maybe it's Lungi who now finds out Sans was chowing his girlfriend and he shoots, you know, oh. Because mm. the way we were told was this thing was a robbery. Yes. Right? Someone popped up. Wow, now that now, now is a, wow, hold on. The way we were told was this thing was a robbery. Yes. Right? Someone popped up, they were all chilling together, gun went off. That's what we've known for eight years. Mm. Eight years. Now there's all these stories surfacing. Called, no, mang mang natural mang mang. The best friend ran away. This is what I'm also one of the things I because I've also haven't been keeping up with the case. But one of the things I heard was what his best friend, when the gunshot went off, he ran into the next door room mm -hmm. or bedroom and tried to jump out there. But I told her the bedla pass, and there was no fast leave. I see fast on I'm fine. I don't know what he said about it. just basically it, the nigga didn't make it, man. He didn't make it, didn't he? He's jumping out that window. I can just tell how he said it. But y'all feel me in, though? Let me know what's going on with this case. What the hell is they talking about? I'm going to dig deeper, y'all. Let's go. <laughs> and there was no fast lead. I see fast on, I'm fine. So I'm like, if it was, so so again, right, back to our speculation or, 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 or whatever the speculation is, if it was someone who's well-known within the circle who shot Senzo, why would I, as the best friend, run out? Mm. You know what I mean? Why wouldn't I be like... Because if, it, if it's a random person who's come in and started shooting, yes, we all run. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. then we'll regroup later. Mm. Hey, what happened? But if it's one of us and the gun goes off by mistake, why am I running? Why am I trying to jump out the window? As but, this, mate? but this narrative kind of fits. Because if you think about the way Kelly has been moving in the media, she hasn't been like... Uh, a widow who's sad that Senzo, she's never like gone and done the whole mandla thing wearing a black hey, justice for Senzo fighting for you know we want to get to the bottom of this she's just been low key but hasn't she been like at the center of like people bashing her yeah people that's also her. yeah you know what I mean so so Kelly's had to like handle this whole situation differently because people have blamed her mm. it's like what what's happening with this there's an American rapper who recently uh, got killed. PNB, I think. Yeah, oh, punk rock or something. Man. Yeah, right. And I love it, man. Like niggas don't even know like how y'all relate to man. This is just so dope, man. Rest in peace, PNB, punk rock, man. That's my nigga, man. Simple as that. People are blaming his girlfriend because they say she tagged the location where they were at <laughs> on social media. Mm -hmm. That so so they tagged that we had Roscoe's chicken and waffle here here. You know the proper date night vibes. Oh. We in the rolls. Oh. We got our Louis Vuittons. We got our Rolls Royces. But on her Insta story, she tagged where they were. Mm. And then they oh, got so robbed and we got found. killed, right? Yeah. Same so thing happened to the... She got... She got... We got over there. She make it a move. Uh, I know. No, I know exactly no. what you're talking about. He also Pops gave... Pop smoke. smoke. There yes. we go. Yes. yes. So, Same so, thing. So now they're blaming her, right? <clears throat> and it's like... Guys, this thing happened. Mm. You know? They, like... this, they These two people were in a relationship. Oak got popped. He died, she's mourning. Mm. But social media is going, this is your fault. Yeah. You shared the location. Mm. You did this. So mm. that's what's been happening with Kelly, right? Mm. Kelly's been getting the flag from day one. Yeah. Even before these things surfaced up. Oh. Yeah. Fill me in um, on this case, y'all. Let me know in the comments box so your boy can dig deeper into it. Maybe also a or or even the fact that she could have pulled the trigger. All these things are only surfacing... Also now for the fact that um usenzo was also married you know and yes. he could be the well side chick you know yes. but if, so... if that story is true then it paints it paints a bad light on senzo because i mean dude this is your side chick now you're telling the side chick's sister but i cannot anything after wife exactly <laughs> <laughs> already was bad <laughs> <laughs> because i was like like oh, you was taking also, the four four two from Asian too far. I want to know from a from a from a from a side chick point of view. He said it is way now. He's taking it literal. I 
I want to know, right? Um, Ghosty, I don't know if you've ever been. Uh, lady fact check, I don't know if you've ever been. Okay. Uh, aside. Oh. As a, as a, uh, I was been aside. So as a side I chick, do you have the right to be upset that there's another? Mm. No, you can't. That's a good question. No, you can't be upset. Because you're aside. Yeah. Right? Especially if you But know. I get you're the side. So can't you be upset because you are the the Yeah. You're doing this official you're side. away from this. Mm. So that's that's when you're entitled side, to the side position. Now if you are feeling entitled to the side position, you feel like you are the only but at the end of the day, there can be another side of a side, you know? Mm. When you go to the restaurant, I mean they say we offer you two sides. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, from Ghost Lady for the view from her. Hey, fellas, get your ears open. Look how these ladies think. Well, it's sad. <laughs> when you go to the restaurant, you get one or two sides. You get two. You feel like you're the only, but at the end of the day, there can be another side of a side. You know? mm. When you go to the restaurant, I mean, they say we offer you two sides. Yeah. Or three sides. Yeah. You know? So, and yeah, this nigga says, no, 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 for me. Look at the side. Can't afford to pay the bill. Oh, <laughs> <God. laughs> hey, this thing is here, bro. Fred <laughs> uh, Jacker, have you ever been the same? Let's hear from a 2000 point. Yes. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, I haven't been aside, fortunately. How would you know? A friend of yours, maybe, that you might know? <laughs> I almost did, oh. but I cut it once I found out. So, yeah. you know, that there I was did a not mistake. Yeah. Mm. Oh, so you were aside for a while? Yeah. Okay. Mm. How did you find out? <laughs> Obviously, like people will always be talking, and he was popular. He's in the fashion vibes, so oh. it got out. Mm, 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 and yeah. I Wait, I don't out. understand. So, what got out? The word. I can't disclose who he is, but he he's a designer, so he has celebrity friends. And the word got out that you're not the only one. There's a oh, main. Oh, so you have to side line. Yeah, I thought Oh, is it Meg G? The fashion Meg G? Mm -mm, I can't disclose. Mm. Are you are you into Meg G's? <laughs> no. That's a shake. That's a shake. I thought you said you can have more than one wife now. I win. <laughs> anyway, Ghost Lady, what's you got for us, man? What's been happening? What's been happening, Ghost Lady? Hey. So guys, have you heard this? Um, my bad, yo, my bad, my bad. Anyway, Ghost Lady, what's he got for us, man? What's been happening? What's been happening, Ghost Lady? Hey. So guys, have you heard this? Um, the relationship here, um, Prince KB and Uzola. Like, so there's just been a lot of, uh, like, Zola. Seven. <laughs> no, Zola. her ah, name is Zola. Hey, hey. Can you think? <laughs> her name is oh, Zola, oh, her okay, name, okay. yes. Mm. So there's been trouble in paradise to the point where, which was kind of interesting for me was that she actually wanted him to cut off his mom financially. Yo! Would you guys allow your woman to, like, take David, it to... Hold on, man, this seems to be a question where which was kind of interesting for me was that she actually wanted him to cut off his mom financially yo would you guys allow your woman to like take you to the extent of saying you must cut off your mother Fuck you know, oh, I she gotta get cut off for you be speaking on that hey I, I i mean it just depends on the situation you know what i'm saying if you building y'all building on a couple but nah it ain't no situation mother that's my dude she's no like he said fuck no my mom to, like oh, well michelle tied it on me stop playing Number one lady Take you to the extent of saying, you must cut off your mother. Fuck, you, you know, are talking to mad. the two biggest mummy's boys. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think, and, and, and uh, tell me if I'm wrong, we're, we're the type of sons, our moms would rather drive the Bentley yeah. than we drive the yeah, yeah, Toyota yeah, 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 yeah. with those boys. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. Yeah. So fuck, that ain't happening. Yeah, so, yeah. so that could be no, 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 never, 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 never. Ah. Forget about it. But isn't she cheating as well? Yeah, so that was the first way all of this started, is that she's also apparently cheating. Mm. And because of the rumors of Chris KB cheating, and now she's retaliating. Is, she, is she cheating with someone that works in fashion? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can't get that guy. We're going to get it. We're going to get it. <laughs> 
we're gonna find it. <laughs> it's just the guys we're thinking of. Huh? Don't we found the site. The phone, you know what I mean? <laughs> is it is it as worse when a celebrity male figure is cheating as opposed to the female of that celebrity? <coughs> So, like, if Prince KB was cheating, is it as bad as his wife cheating or his girlfriend? Mm. Do you get my question? I get your question because, you know, I, I think we go, okay, in the relationship, this is the famous one. Yes. This is the it's one who, who makes the money. This is the one who's, who has more temptations and mm, whatever mm, mm. to yeah, face. It's obvious. And then, bah, it ends up being the wife mm. that ends up cheating on him. It is a bit of a shock to the system. That's why when you hear news like that, you go... She's cheating probably because he cheats. Of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That was never a reason. You never think, ha, ah, how could you do uh, Prince KB like that? You think, ooh, what has he done it's in to order. push her to get to the point where Okay, which one, which one will have more likes on Musa Kaule's page? Prince KB cheating? These are his eight girlfriends? Or the wife. Or the wife is cheating? Definitely the wife. Why? That's what I'm trying to understand. Why is it like that? Because... You don't expect the woman. You don't, you don't expect, expect the woman, hmm. number one. Uh, or never mind just a woman. In in a relationship of the person... You know, let me pivot. And that's who really... Shh, man, it's crazy out here. The woman wants to be really... Shh, what? Definitely the wife. Why? That's what I'm trying to understand. Why is oh. it like that? Because... You don't expect the woman. You don't, you don't expect, expect the woman, crazy. number one. Uh, or never mind just a woman. In, in a relationship of the person who's the higher power, mm. you don't expect the, the other person to be the one doing that. Mm. Not, even if the roles were reversed. Even if it was the woman who was famous... And the guy wasn't famous, and he's cheating. You know, mm. you know, like a like a mom kisses mm. ex husband, mm. and you and you're like, ah, we done, we done. Oh, this pillar and your mother. It's not a rap yet. We're climbing tiny, climbing tiny, we're gonna lose some of it. Oh, I get you. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. it's like. It's, it, well, whatever the scale is, it's a status that, thing. It's not yeah, a gender thing, right? So, so the one that's going to get the more traction is the one who's done wrong to the person. So the wife will obviously get the wife cheating or, or Zola cheating in this case mm. will get more traction on a on a on a gossip page because we're like, yo, what did homie do? Mm. Or for people who might have other backstories, they go, oh, this is revenge for when he sent that two page beep. Mm. You know what I mean? <laughs> ah, nah, I see more need the songs. Yeah, ah, uh. Prince KBI. His, his fingers didn't even touch. You know what I mean? They didn't go all the way around. <laughs> his hand was up here. You've seen him, DJ. He's got big hands. It finished here. They were still like. <laughs> ah, guys. Ah, guys. Ah, uh, uh. I'm not the only one that saw that thing. I'm, <laughs> Oh, so, so, that, so you see that you go, oh, maybe that's because of his behavior. Yeah. Maybe that's why nah, I got he, you, decided, he decided to step up. But either way, man, like... What happened to Vizita Maguire's man. wife? The reason they're getting a divorce? She was on drugs or something. I read an article, she was on drugs or something. Is that, Please the, check is that what Boosie's saying? Or is that like a fact? Yeah, in court or something. That's what he's saying. No, but he no, no, I'm, 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 no, I'm asking, thing. I'm saying, is it, is it Vusi's statement or is it like a, is it a thing that they, that they found out in the case? Check, check the article first, they fetch it. But there's a GPV case, like, mm. yeah, because I, he allegedly, like, beat her. Mm. So that's... Have you ever been cheated on while you were famous? Uh, while I was famous, why do you have your hand up? <laughs> what do you know, fact check? Fact check, I talk about <laughs> You're the designer. <laughs> um, no, it's on the Vusi Tembe Gwaiya case. Um, it doesn't say anything about um, the drugs, but it does stipulate that there were gender violence mm. cases. Or no, man. I'm so again, you, again, so, so, so you see what, why I'm asking, Or isn't right? that what he alleged about her? That's, yes. what, yes. that's what it's yes. stipulating it? that he alleged it. Yes. But it's not stating that she was on drugs. Mm. I don't see anything mm. about... So it's both alleged on the, on both sides. Both sides. Because let's not forget what these what these things do to people's careers, right? Because mm. we know Vus Temkwai as Vus Temkwai. Yes. Tem Kwai from the Zulu Mini Crisis. Yeah. You know, Vus Temkwai. Yeah. So then this thing surfaces, right? Mm -hmm. And then it's, it's one of those things where you're just like, what? 
Vusi hitting his wife doesn't make sense. Mm. Now all of a sudden, wife is on drugs doesn't make sense. Mm. We don't know, right? So I'm just like with, with things like this, where there's an alleged on this side, alleged on this side, we almost have to let these things play out. Otherwise, we'll find ourselves in, in a position where people's careers have ended, guys. Look at Tolles Moore. Tolles Moore, 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 right? Yes. Three and a half years. Mm. Was it that long? Three Yo. and a half years. This man has been battling um, a rape allegation, yeah. right? But for that three... Damn, that's crazy. Three and a half years. People weren't like, let's wait and see. No. For three and a half years, people were like, there were That's groups, there were what, what. Mm. There were people who were like, mm. yeah, Mo, what. He got pulled off everything. Everywhere. He got cancelled on everything. Mm-hmm. I actually got the pleasure of watching Mo's first show. Yeah. On Tuesday. Yeah. Oh. Yo, guys, it was, was the it? most emotional wow. thing. When he walked on, we were at Kofi. In, yeah. In Centurion. When he walked on, he got a standing ovation. Wow. He went on stage. He was, I spoke to him before the show. He was super nervous. Yet, imagine, you haven't been on stage for two oh, and a half years. Yeah. Comedy is one of those things. It's a muscle. You yeah, have to yeah, keep yeah. training it. To be oh. Like soccer, yeah. Yeah. He went on stage and he did, like, he did almost an hour. He did about 45 to 50 minutes on stage. Oh. And he spoke about what he went through. Wow. Twasa. Wow. He spoke about things only Mo could talk about. Yeah. And he killed. He destroyed. And at the end, he wow. burst into tears, bro. And again, no, you why at coffee? He's gonna big, come on the show. Big standing ovation. Oh. People hey, go. I know he probably came on the show right now. Y'all get down with episode. If he pulled up on the show, let me know. Get down the episode for me so I can react to it. Do a Dr. Malik. No, he's he's not not actually, crying. he wasted his tears at coffee. <laughs> <laughs> if he comes to cry here, ah. Mac what is judge. <laughs> Mac. Hey, hey. Why is it? He's about to Please light the bottom. 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 Please light <laughs> hey, those tears have helped. Hey, what yes. <laughs> bookie? Hey, hey. <laughs> New gig, what is your job? <laughs> Come and perform at half time. Thanks, bye. <laughs> oh, thanks, bye. Make a way to you. Hey, when I can always hit the remote hotel, summer summer. Hey, these niggas, Mo Pop got them weak as hell, y'all. He's silly as fuck, man. But hey, it makes so much sense. This is why he's a comedian, y'all. Let's go. Let's get it. He's showing out. He's showing out. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, yo, hey. <laughs> oh, hey, me the other day. This nigga uh-huh. IG is in tears. Tears, tears. For real, for real. Talking about a nigga coming over here crying. He got this nigga laughing in tears. Pori gave him 25,000. Oh. My Pori, so yeah. Really? Nice. Yeah, man. He's doing well. You're right, man. Like, I follow him on WhatsApp yeah. now. So I follow I follow him on so I've always followed him on social media. <laughs> Dog. <laughs> for everyone who says the podcast, uh, what what you know, all the all the post podcast haters. Yeah. I'm looking at you right now. Uh, guys, when you come on the podcast, <laughs> like changes. Look at that name one of the Ah, come next week, Saturday! Heritage celebration! What is yours? <laughs> <laughs> Entertainment! <laughs> How many bookings did Lingas get after the show, Yay. guys? Yay. Immediately after the show, and Makazir Raga Everyone followed. This man is booked. And, and one thing that really touched my heart is I think he, he tweeted that he he's managed to pay a certain amount. Yeah, 100,000. Yeah, 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 two sides. Two sides, yeah. yes. Oh, dog. Look, Look at, at that. He's back. Tell Just them kicking. about the story of you the Baba. The one you, you, you were telling us before oh, uh, yes, uh, you came on the show. Yes. yes. So, so I remember. You see, talking about uh, coming on the podcast and, mm. and, and, and your life changing. So one of the first things I did in the beginning of the year, uh, when I came out of rehabilitation, yeah, yeah. I came to the podcast. Mm. I remember we spoke when I was still in rehab. Right? Mm. And you were like, dude, when you're done, what's your name? Yeah. What's your name? What's Hey y'all, 
pivot down, man, if he put his information out there. What was he in rehab for, man? I'm just curious. If Just put it in the comments if you know. But let's go and let's get it. <laughs> that got some calm out loud. Back your own depression, man. <laughs> What the job, bro? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, man. So, so, so before I came to Kala, you know, uh, I remember the one time when I when I was because I, I was in rehabilitation in White River, right? And what they took us on an excursion on, on, yeah. on one of the, the days. We went to the big swing, you know, jumping off. The, oh, you, know, yeah. you have to do activities to get you into the swing of things. <laughs> so the one of the shops that was there at the big swing was this uh, shop, Dibaba. Mm. And I remember I got to Dibaba, I asked the, the two ladies working there, what's Dibaba? I don't know, it's a local brand, what, 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 what. I, oh, dope. I bought a top, I bought a sweater, didn't think anything of it, shop, boom. Yeah. Then when I got out, I remember you were like, hey dude, what's your cut? Mm. Right, and then we made an arrangement to come to the podcast. And on that day, I wore my black Dibaba top. Mm -hmm. I wore a black Dibaba top. We had our interview. Turned out to be a dope ass episode. I think we're approaching nine hundred thousand. For real? Hey, yeah. Hey, Not that I check all the time. <laughs> <laughs> but the lunch is humbad, you okay. know. Okay. <laughs> is it the one where we've got lost lava in the bag? Yeah. <laughs> Comment down that interview, he talking about say boy can check it out. Simple is that it? <laughs> so, <laughs> so I, I rock this Dibaba top. We have our episode dope, sharp. Last week, uh, I'm in Rosebank, right? I'm going to Shelf Life mm. to go to go get sneakers. And there's this guy literally outside of Rose Shelf Life. Bank, he sees me. Sean. Mm. So normally I'm like, hey, I can see, I can smell a conversation coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let From me hit, yeah, yeah. So let me hear it. Sean Tala and walk past, yeah, past yeah. you know. So I'm like, sure, my guy. Quickly going to shop like, I'm going to my Uber. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I must have spent like 15, 20 minutes in shelf life, you know, wow. looking at stuff. Trying, like, I get along well with everyone in shelf life. When I come out, this dude is waiting for me at the at the door. I'm like, yo, this guy. 20 minutes. He's probably been waiting here. For now you feel minutes. bad. Now I feel bad. And yeah. he's got his phone out. I'm like, yo, this dude's been waiting for a picture for 20 minutes. Wow. Yeah. So I approach him. He's like, hey, show him pose. Mm. You know, he introduces himself. Mm. And then he goes, yo, man, you have no idea what you've done for my business. I'm like, what are you talking about? He's like, I am Dibaba. Mm. I own Dibaba. And you went on the podcast and you wore one wow. of my t-shirts. And ever since your episode on the podcast... Oh. Business has been wow. boom. Oh. It's like immediately after the episode, it blew up. Wow. People wanted Dibaba merchandise. They got a hold of me. I've been printing. I've been moving units. And he's like, he had a, a, a business uh, in Joburg. So Dibaba is actually from this mm. side, from Kokas. But it was under the store was unsuccessful, and I think COVID hit, and he got an opportunity. I think through tourism oh. to go and open up where I saw him by the mm. big swing in Pumalanga. And that's one of the franchises he had. But since the episode, it blew up, right? Wow. Dibaba blew up. Mm. Dog, I don't know. I just that's wore crazy. Dibaba talk yeah, to come see your Nizos Kale, right? Wow. And then, in in his... So he while I was in Shelf Life, he quickly ran to his car, mm. found like three tops, put them in a bag, and came. Mm. So while he's holding his phone, he's got a, a pack of stuff. He's like, yo, here's some t-shirts. Mm. I hope they fit. I just want to say thank you. Uh, we exchanged numbers. It's a black like, person. It's a black dude. Oh, a black dude, better, dude better. Though, you know? Oh. And so when you gave me a call to say, hey, Antoine, mm. solo show in monkey box. <laughs> Antoine, I am back. He's a car. He's a car, Antoine. He's in the middle. I have, I have it in my head to think it's not Mikey Pox. It's all the bags that Sol has been getting there. They're too much. They're too much. It's <laughs> itchy. There's too much money. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. No, tell me. No, tell me. See what the fuck does that do? I love it, man. What is he? So, dog, when you called me to say, come through, I remember thinking, because the normal thing, like, yeah, so what am I going to wear? And I saw the bag, I was like, oh, let me rock. Cool. So this, I literally pulled out of the bag that wow, he gave me. Man. 
last week. And to think, like, you literally called me mm. just now. All right, uh-huh. Donna, let's rock. Fucking hell, that's uh, amazing. Wow. Speaking about black businesses, man, we've got another chiller. So this is a Wi-Fi power supply. So during load sharing, mm-hmm. if you want to power your Wi-Fi, this is the, the baby you should get. Oh. Wait, so what does it do? Like, does it have its own, yeah, so like, battery? Got, yeah. So if you've got a router, right? Mm-hmm. So let's say this is the router. You plug that into your router, and during load shedding, your Wi-Fi will stay on. Oh, it's like a power bank for your router. Yeah. Okay, that's dope. How long does this last? Hey, uh, about- y'all call it router, we call it router, man. So it's dope learning the lingo, man. But hey, damn, we didn't... This is tough, man. So y'all got shit... Y'all... y'all I love how y'all don't let load shedding affect y'all. Y'all like, fuck it, we creators over here. You plug that into your router, and during load shedding, your Wi-Fi will stay on. Oh, it's like a power bank for your router. Yeah. Okay, that's dope. How long does this last? Uh, about four hours. Black ah, owned company. Ah. Black owned? Yeah, black owned, man. He's a chiller, ah. pushing. So it's oh, good for this stage six. Chiller, yeah. Yeah. Now it's good. Just Nelson. Yeah, this is what we need for stage six. Uh, the power supply has a built-in rechargeable battery. When there's yeah. load sharing, the battery assists by powering the router and fiber box for up to four hours. When electricity comes back, the device will take an hour to fully charge since it will be connected to the main power so- oh, socket. Dope. Oh, dope. The device works for all fiber routers and LTE routers. Once connected, you don't need to disconnect and, and it connects automatically. Oh. So how do we... How do we yeah, how yeah, do we yeah. yeah. Let me get, how let much me get, is yeah, it? Yeah, man. Let me get the details. But you see, people are pushing, man. People are pushing, man. It's so great to see. And we need to support each other. That's whether whether, whether it's consciously or unconsciously. You know what I mean? It's that simple. Simple, uh, you can follow them cool. on Instagram, kestamelson.ups. That's K E S T A. Well, I'll put everything up. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, 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 so we know how much it is, where we, yeah, where we can get it. Yeah, Please. yeah, yeah, man. Uh, oh, fuck, man. That's amazing. I'm bro. a follow. That's amazing, man. That's all we got to do as black people, bro. Just support each other. Yep. You know what I mean? Yep. That, we, we must. You know, like, we, if ever there's an opportunity to put each other on, we must put each other on, guys. Mm. I, there was a time I, I phoned Mac because there's there, you, I was at the gym, right? Are you still gymming, by the way? Hey, man, I did we for a week. Yeah, I did for a week. <laughs> 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 you did for one week. Yeah. Hey, when you can't commit to nothing. Eh? <laughs> Except drinking. <laughs> <laughs> so there's this guy that I gym with and he was like, you know, uh, he looks, I, I call him small Zulu. Mm. He, lo- he looks like big Zulu without the traits. Oh, you know? Okay. So he, I remember the one time with Jimmy and he comes up to me, he's like... And let me pivot, though, before we get too far from it. I bet all y'all niggas got this, though. Y'all, if y'all got that supply, y'all better get on it for real, for real. Simple as that. If you don't know about it now, you know. Uh, he looks... I, I call him Small Zulu. Mm. He, lo- he looks like Big Zulu without the dreads, oh, you know? Okay. So he... Small I remember the one time big Zulu. with Jimmy and he comes up to me, he's like... Okay. <laughs> Small Zulu, Big Zulu. <laughs> <laughs> you can't it took, yeah, I had a laugh at it. It took him a second to hit that nigga. I was like, this nigga silly as fuck, bro. I see if I don't know your name, I'll give you a name. <laughs> no, this guy literally comes, you know, his name's Derek. He comes to me. He's like, yo, man, can I talk to you after gym? So I'm like, ah, you know, you know, we always have banter. Let's chat. Mm. Oh, immediately after gym, we sit there by the Kauai. This man hits PowerPoint presentation. Wow. Oh. I am Derek. I work for this and this and this. I heard MacGyver saying he's struggling with his grandiose. Yeah. So I can get him here, here, here. What, what? So he has a whole PowerPoint presentation. Mm. Hey. And he's like, if you can help me, put, I, we can put him on, we can do this. Uh, and then, you know, you can cut it. Deal. I'm like, yo, I don't want nothing, bro. Yeah. If you say you can get my boy into mm. all the, the tops and what, what. Mm. Yeah. Here's his number. Mm. You know what I mean? And I literally, I said, give me your number. I'm going to give it to me. Yeah. Mm. And that, that's all I did. You yeah. know what I mean? And that's, I feel like as, as black people, if, we, if you're in a space where you can move someone on. Yeah. yeah. Don't do it because you're going to stand benefit. to benefit. Yeah. I think that's going to a common government level. Yeah. Mm. Is, yo man, let's build something. No, no, but I need to get something. Yeah. Mm. I'm the one that connected you to the guy who makes the top. Mm. Mm. So I need, no guys. Just get the top done. Get, yeah. Just get it done. Get it oh, done. he can do it. Let oh, you do this. You can do that. Mm-hmm. Here's the people. Boom. Mm-hmm. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Mm-hmm. So that whole part, I said through a 42 minute PowerPoint presentation oh. only to say, I'll get the number. Okay. You and know the know thing I mean? is, you might not even claim that now, but because of that relationship you've built with that guy or the Debaba guy, right? For yeah. example. Yeah. yeah. Uh, in 20 years time, which is what I saw with Drip, because we started at the same time when nobody knew Drip, not even Casper. 
Hawa. Hawa. No, I'm just holding it over. Okay. Hawa. Okay. Okay. Uh, shut, shut, shut. <laughs> So it was a startup, right? <coughs> and look how big Drip is right now, right? Mm -hmm. So imagine, so just because of your relationship with this Dibaba guy, if your daughter grows up and wants to be in fashion and Dibaba now is Louis Vuitton mm -hmm. of fashion, yeah, look at it's just a phone call away. Yes. To like, yo, my daughter, boom, boom, boom. Yes. Yes. Which is what these white people do. Mm -hmm. That's how they keep generational wealth. Exactly. So that's why if we can put each other on, guys, if we can put each other on. Free games, Let's put each other on. Just plug. Just plug. Just, just, just play. play. Plug and play. Because <laughs> one day you can come from being super gill to affording to pay the bill. And Zai Zai. And Zai Zai. <laughs> hey, by the way, Grand Jeer is now available at all macro stores. So head out to your nearest macro and get yourself a bottle of Grand Jeer. Ghost Lady. Are they restocked in Dwayne? Yeah, hey, they're always sold out. Hey, hey, I was at macro the one time. Yeah. I'm buying Crenjo. I'm like, ah, guys, where's the Crenjo? But ah, the truck never made it. Yeah. <laughs> Can I let me? Made. You know when you're like, you know, I, I don't like to name drop, but you know in the moment when you're just like, hey, let me phone my boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mac, Donna. What's up? We are on a shelf end. I'm a piliato a I feel the high. They're making me do this. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you gotta use your motherfucking resources. He's silly. He's silly. <laughs> that nigga's like, my boy, man. But you couldn't have fought the Beely. <laughs> I couldn't have fought the Beely. I couldn't have fought the Beely. I had to rent your mind. <laughs> so I'm looking at the Granger uh, aisle. So I'm at Fun Mac. And hey, Donna. Um, Where's the truck? Hey, Antoine, there's no Grand Jewel here, Antoine. Where's the... And Meg is like, yeah, Antoine, hey, hey, my man, my man, my man. Yeah, the truck with the Grand Jewel by Shai. It's <laughs> 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 what? Like, yeah, they, it's been hijacked. <laughs> 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 so, can you realize there's some niggas in the castle right now? He look on the mirror. Yes, sir. Are you sure, Antoine? He's not going to be here. So, right now, <laughs> niggas were drinking Grand Jewel because it came as doula. <laughs> now they know. Oh, shit, man. I uh, need to plug each other. Oh, God, oh shit. Uh, before we head out, Ghost Lady, oh, Rings of Power, are you still watching? I'm still watching. Are we still together? We're still together. Yeah? Are you watching? Yeah, of course, course man. Yeah. Yeah. It's one of my favorite I, series I, at the I moment. I need to watch. Rings of Power, you got it, bro. Yeah, yeah man. I, I, instead of being spectating the... The commentary. Yeah, yeah. You know, I've been I've been watching that. I haven't gotten into it. I haven't had time. Okay. Mm. But again, we're having this like racial debate on stuff online. Mm. I see because people are like, you know, like the proper a lot of the Rings fans. Yeah. Are like, yo, where the black elves coming from? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> which one is this? One? Which one is this? One? <laughs> where the black elves coming from? Wow. You know, like the proper a lot of the Rings fans. Yeah. Are like, yo. Where the black elves coming from? Yeah. Where the, where <laughs> Which one is this one? <laughs> Which one is this one? Where is where is black elves coming from? <laughs> 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 they need to be trying to be inclusive. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, you know what I mean. Like, this is a white world. <laughs> no, no, I know, but also it's fantasy. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it's, fantasy, so it's, it's fantasy. So it's like you can always reimagine fantasy. Exactly. And you, you gotta move this, with the time. You have the staunch fans going, "Yo, yeah, there was no black elves." Yeah. Now all of a sudden. Where did these niggas go? <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you check it out on Prime Video, man. You gotta check it out. It reminds me, there's actually a debate happening right now with the Black Mermaid. Yes. Yeah. 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 So the the I saw the well. The last time I checked, it was sitting the trailer, on there. the trailer was at 1.4 million dislikes. dislikes. Damn. You know what I mean? And and here's here's my thing, right? So I I want I want to put it out. M mermaid can be black. Like damn. What they said dislikes. Like, damn. You know what I mean? And. And here's here's my thing, right? So I I wanna I wanna put it out there, right, guys? Look, I feel like you build an audience, right? Mm -hmm. You build an audience, whether you're a Lord of the Rings franchise, yeah. whether you're a, a Disney or whatever Little Mermaid franchise, yeah. you build an audience, right? And then later, you have the social responsibility to start being inclusive. Yeah. So now you start throwing in black characters. Yeah. Uh, you know, but now. 
you're forgetting about that 600 million plus mm. fan base that you built of yeah. Staunch, yeah. staunch. Mm. And we're not saying that they're racist. Mm. We're just going, this is the world you've created. Yeah. yeah. This is the world that I know. 100%. This is all the picture of that people a, know. Yes, this is the and picture all that of a I sudden know. You put a picture all of a sudden, it's a different person. There's, there's a... There's a there's a little black girl with 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 braids. Let me check it out. Swimming. Underwater. 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 <laughs> I realized that in SA we are too woke, bro. Mm -hmm. And we inherited that from America. It's uh -huh. not us. It's not us and bro. that's what I love about uh, people in Dubai. They were never stripped away of their culture. That's why they still wear things like this. Mm -hmm. So they are developed in terms of infrastructure and whatnot. But their belief system, their culture hasn't changed. Mm -hmm. They've remained true to it. And I think as Africans, if we remained true to our culture, we'd be far off. Because right now we are so, it's like, okay, what are they doing in the UK? We take that. We are deaf. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah, what are they doing in the but US? We forget culture. Things, when, it, when it happens to us, the rules change. Yeah. And, 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 and I'll, I'll, like, oh, yes. I'll, I'll, I'll make an example, right? Uh -huh. So right now, as I say, we're probably championing and we're behind Ariel being black. Mm. Yes, it's about time. It's our chance. It's our chance. When I say that 600 million base of mm. people that has developed from a, uh, uh, let's say, Ariel, uh, 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 Little Mermaid yeah. fan base, right? I'm not just talking about white people. Mm -hmm. It's not just white people who are going, yo, you've upset the equilibrium yeah. of things. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's the Islamic people. It's the, you know, Hispanics. It's the Asian people. It's mm -hmm. everyone around the world who goes, this is how we know this thing. Bro, you, you make such a perfect example. Because right? I'm a staunch fan of Survivor. Mm -hmm. And as the world, like especially in America, has become more woke, they've become more woke in Survivor and it's not what I subscribe to exactly. it's not why I like Survivor exactly. so now I prefer the Australian one because it's just Survivor it's not now the American one is more political yeah, they're trying to take all the LGBT yeah which what, is nothing what wrong race, what, what. But, but again if you like and that's my argument is that guys this is a fantasy world mm -hmm. right and, and, and I'll flip it on us and I'll go right now we're shooting Shaka Zulu mm. right mm. finally mm. finally we're going to have Shaka Zulu in Shaka. Zulu yeah, yeah, shout out. Shout out to Naga, did he get the role? Yeah, he... <laughs> 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 you listen to Naga's don't like him, this guy, right? I had it, I had it. That guy, I had it. No, no, it's not that comparison. <laughs> Check, man, episode 3, I'm not going to go. Yes, Shaka's No, so, so Shaka's, is, we, we, we're doing Shaka's, we're redoing it, and it's going to be in Zulu. Because mm. I don't know if you guys remember, the first one was in English. Yeah. yeah the yeah. one with, serious, with Henry. With it English. was in English. Yeah, it was in English. But, and you, like, I only realized later when, when DJ Import that I work with yeah. played me old clips, and you could hear the general going, yeah, too cumbersome, general. Like, wait, <laughs> whoa, wait a minute. <laughs> the only Zulu was like the backtracks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, boom, boom, yeah, boom, boom. boom. Yeah. Okay. There was a scene when Shaka ran away, hey. and then the lady was saying, Ushaka, uya kiichi, mama. <laughs> Ushaka, uya kiichi. And then you see him climbing a mountain, Ushaka, uya kiichi. <laughs> that was the only Zulu in Shaka Zulu. <laughs> Other than that, everything was English, right? So, so now, which brings me back to my example, is if we're really woke and inclusive and whatnot, mm. then we won't have a problem with having. Asian actors in Shaka's movie. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Now, now, fuck. Now Shaka's... Sh Shaka's you could Zulu. some white people in the Zulu yeah. tribe. You know, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. He could be Asian. Shaka could be Asian. Sh Shaka could be an Asian mm. guy. Or uh, uh, we have members of the LGBTQ mm. community as... You know what I mean? Is he All of a sudden, you're going to upset everyone. Mm. No, this is not what what. But now we're getting upset at a bunch of people who are going, Yo... Ariel wasn't black mm. when we started this out. I can't uh, 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 Lord of the Rings didn't have, you know, black elves and whatnot. So, so it's about... It's like having a white soul. Imagine. Imagine a white soul. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck! <laughs> Just this <much>. yeah. <laughs> I, I get what I want. <laughs> inclusive, right? <laughs> 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 and 
Asian ghostly. <laughs> so young. <laughs> Podcast and chill, Suya is here, Sol Kouamas is here, Sol, va te très bien this week. This is because we're trying to be inclusive. Then we lose this. Yeah. Then we lose yeah. this. Yeah. Mo Pop is just hilarious, y'all. I love his presentation. Like, he's funny as fuck, y'all. Let's go, let's get. I'm excited to get back into popcorn and cheese. People that have you're helped right, you get to a hundred yes. million views yeah. are gonna be upset. Yeah, you're right, man. Do you know what I mean? You. So we gotta we gotta be sort of cognizant of I'm how, telling you. How, we, how we introduce Pops, this, this wokeness is killing us, bro. It's, ki- it's we killing gotta go back us. to our roots. That's why I love all these celebrities who are twasaring and whatnot. That's the only way, bro. We gotta go back to our roots. I'm telling you, this wokeness. It's an American thing, bro. Yeah, it's foreign. It doesn't fun. fit. Also, I feel like we we're going through a lot of other challenges. Mm. Yeah. We're not at woke level yet. Yes, mm. we're not at woke level. You know, yet. we're still dealing with other things. And I hear you. Yeah, gonna twist the song. Gonna see long again. Oh yeah. Could never date me to twist it. Imagine the peasy all of a sudden. Ow. And then. Malone. He got these niggas weak as fuck, especially my dear. <laughs> Hey man, we are here at the Selby Podcast and chill. Round of applause for our guest calls. Pop, pop, pop. Yo, thank you so much for having me, guys. No, man, thanks for having thank me as well, man. Me. At your, at your, uh, oh, your show. birthday show. Oh, oh man, that dude, was, that's... Bro, there was so much love in the room there, man. Dude. Dude, my, yo, my mom was so happy when she saw you and Soul, bro. Yeah. Thank you, next time you're going to make piece in your neck. You only treat this young as a case of the green job. Oh man, it was, it was beautiful. Honestly, my birthday show was so magical. It was it was the first big thing that happened after after being, after being on, on on the podcast. Oh, okay, right. okay. Uh, and I and I know well, this is the second time on the podcast. We got to get to that first episode. The re- and that's why I'm I'm here saying thank you because I realized how many chillers were also at the mm. show, right? mm. and how I realized there were so many chillers at the show. Everyone on my birthday show was a surprise mm. from from the ex. To Mac, mm. do you know what I mean? So no one knew. Everyone thought they just come in to see me, mm. and then I got on stage and Louis Ocala was there. So mm. oh, was Celeste, and then I was I was like, oh, of, of course, and also the official DJ for the show, give it up for Mac G. When I said that, yo, oh, the crowd Went lost crazy. their minds. People stood up. People were screaming. Yeah. It took us time for them to settle down before we could carry on with the oh. show. Yeah. And then Mac comes onto stage, hey, chill, chill, chill. <laughs> and then he sits. <laughs> Honestly, I appreciate it, man. Saul was also there, yeah. you know, like, so to see you guys there, the support, you know, uh, uh, guys, thank you so much, man. Like, from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate that show. That show was the first, because that show happened two days after they announced that we could open up now. Mm. So I had already sold out capacity. We opened up more tickets. Those tickets sold out, and it became this, like, huge thing, man. man. So, what are you doing now? What are you busy with? Yo, dude, right now I am I'm going I'm I'm going through what Saul's going through. Yeah. Oh, the chicken pox are coming. Nah, they're coming. I can feel them. No 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 I'm I'm honestly booked and busy. busy. Today, oh yes. Crazy B&B. season. Bro. It is busy. crazy season. And and like I said, everything from this year, like my year has just had this huge trajectory, like it's just and and right now my calendar is full. Like today was supposed to be my first day off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All I had was a, a Zoom call and a presentation to do. Yeah. But you know when 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 the call comes in. Hey. Yes. When the chic calls. When the chic calls. Hey. Yes. 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 I'm there. Yes. 
Sie sollen sich Tribute, die nächste Song, kann man... Hey man, we are so, here. So man, yeah, you, book, man. book and busy. Um, yeah, yeah man, and then after this crazy season, I'm going back on the road, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shit, yeah. 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 We wanted to... Are we still going back on the road together? Yeah, man? dog. Nah. Me, I've, me, I've got the, the thingies on lockdown. Okay. I've got the, the venues on lockdown. Yes. When you're ready, yeah. we are doing that show. Yeah. I even got a call from Sun Coast. Damn. Durban. Damn. There's a lady who called me from Sun Coast. At, I'm funny next. I'm funny mali. I'm funny next. I'm funny nizo yenza. I, I krili nyaga sol penduka la. Ne live show yenu la. Oh. Organize the venue. I'll do everything. All you gotta do is just come here. Bro, we've been speaking about it for years, bro. Let's do it, man. There's a lady who, if we do this for her, yeah. they're gonna put her on. Ah, and she lovely. can give us access. So, <laughs> lovely. Oh, let's do it. Done deal. I'm gonna speak to the team. It's mm. done. Mm -hmm. right. Clean, man. We're out here. Ghost lady, anything you wanna say? Uh, no, guys. Thank you so much, Mpo. Ghost lady. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you have no idea how happy I am to finally. Like, this is my third time, and then I get to finally see you. Oh, you've never seen. Third time. So we got two more episodes we got to react to. Simple as that, man. And it's crazy. Niggas really don't get to see Ghost Lady. You have no idea how happy I am to find it. Like, this is my third time. And then I get to finally see you. Oh, you've never seen her before? I didn't even know the Ghost Lady color. No, but <laughs> it's not. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time, Hermes. We still thinking next on the baby girl, yeah. Kanti. I'm checking the bell, yeah. <laughs> This nigga is silly. Just adding mystery. Hey man, can you yeah. sign out with the biggest song in Dubai right now? <laughs> I, you know, just I know, I know it, man. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know yeah it, can man. you play the biggest song in Dubai right now? Where is oh, it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. In Dubai? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Playing out <laughs> this episode of Podcast and Chill. Yeah, man. From the shake himself. Hey. Yeah, man. You know how the song came about, ne? So, Sfiso, who's Saul's uh, manager. Yeah. He works with Sir Trill in them, right? So, mm -hmm. I went to their studio. They played me about 20 tracks, dog, for the EP, right? So I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah these are dope, man. Done. But I'm looking for the sound, man. This is what I'm looking for. So explain. And then they gave me the song. I'm like, this is the one. Did they, oh, so as you explained it, they played you something, you're like, this, this is the one. one. They just threw it away, bro. They were not going to use it. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. This is a banger, though. Yeah. yeah. Now it's the biggest song in Dubai. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey. <laughs> Habibi. Hey. Habibi. <laughs> Smack G, Central, Bailey, MK is in Kanti. Do a, do a radio intro for it there. All right, thank you. I'm going to say it. What's, what's, what's the, it's a Central? Central, Bailey, MK is in Kanti. In Kanti. It's Bailey, the Central, Mac G, in Kantini, Keo Yazala, all the way from Dubai, here in South Africa, with the Sheikh himself, Harikaling Mino, Wadi Jaja. Hey, hey, hey. America, simple the Africa's number one podcast, podcast can chill, episode 392, Mopo Pops with Mac G, let's go and let's get it, niggas had his week from start to finish, simple as that, y'all, let's go and let's get it, man, we learned a lot, we learned a lot about our boy Soul, we learned about our boy, uh, Robot Boy, Robot, I, I be messing his name up, but it's all good, man, so we gotta dig into the team, man, simple as that, this was a dope episode, thank you for throwing us this, you know exactly who you are, you said, Vern, if you wanna laugh, make sure you check out this episode, so thank you, didn't know about it, if you would ever through this, it's simple as that, but I have nothing else to say other than if you watch this video to this point with your boy and you enjoy this reaction, hit that like button, if you knew you're not part of the team, not part of energy, not part of the family, what are you doing, what are you doing, hit that subscribe button just to click the support, if you part of the team, keep a smile on your face, stay Pray to keep your faith up. Get the comments down below. And all you guys, make sure you have a blessed day, a blessed night. I'm up out of here, guys. Have a blessed one.